I did if she runs. <clears throat> She's gonna surf down it apparently, or ski down it. This is hole seven at the Rattlesnake Canyon. I love the ramp from the ravine though. On hole seven. And it's cool just seeing it elevated because it just kind of like flies. I think Kate threw it further than me that time. Maybe, I don't know, maybe not. I'm not complaining, he just told me he made a par four course or whatever and I'm like, this is one of the hardest courses there was one hole yesterday that took us like eight throws to get to it. Oh, there's been a couple already today. But there's one that's like really far. Well, there's, there's James's. I did throw a far there. Huh? On this one. Like mine's way up there on this one. Oh, is it that one way up there on that hill straight up there? I'd be beating you by like six strokes right now or something. <sighs> so here's Kate's second throw. And that was a, close to where mine went. I think she threw it further than me, so. There's James's. And mine's up there again. They're in a little bit farther than him this time, but he's really like a lot better at these. This closer range he does better at. I was also worried about the yucca, yucca. That I was gonna like step into the yucca when I was throwing. So here's Kate's third throw on hole seven. She threw it really low. We'll see if it skips. And it did a little bit. So that was pretty good. We're in almost the same spot. So yeah, Kate got a four. We basically played pretty even on this one. That's like my best hole so far. No. This is hole eight. James is a lefty, so his stars are always a little bit. Well, I think it should be okay, but I didn't see it roll anywhere, so it should be interesting to see if it went right into a yucca plant. But it did go close to the river, or close to the stream, which is good. So here's Kate's first throw, and hers is going right where it wants to go on the riverbed. So that was good. You could see the dirt too, so her spot's probably going to be a little better than mine. We did it right next to each other. We had like the exact same throw. I know. That's pretty cool. That's pretty impressive. It's crazy we threw it the exact same distance. So here's Kate's second throw on hole eight. Hers is going to the right as well. Kind of where mine went. It makes it challenging to throw it exactly straight. That's why yesterday it was pretty windy, so I decided not to play this hole. So here's Kate's throw. Uh, it's mine's up on the hill in a better spot than Kate's, luckily. So Kate's throwing her third shot on hole eight. You want to keep going in the ravine, yeah. So hers is gonna be okay. James is right in front of me. This is Kate's fourth throw. So we're on throw four and we're still not even like there yet. That was pretty good because it was straight and low. I'm surprised I'm surprised I'm surprised I'm here. Here's my fourth throw. Can't see the hole yet. <laughs> he made this one really long. That was a really nice throw. Yeah, and I just threw it way past because the hole's right there. Where's the hole? Right there. Oh, mine's closer. I know. <laughs> you couldn't see the hole, but it's right there. So I threw mine like way further down than I needed to. 
And so Kate's really close now. Good job. <laughs> so luckily the one time I don't throw as well helps me. This is my chance to beat him on this hole. Really good. Yay! All right, we're rocking two. Hole nine. You could go right here because there's a trail. No. <laughs> the cows already made us a trail. The hole is like way down there. My Pyravita bottle. Yay, Pyravita. So here's Kate's first throw on hole nine. And hers is sailing as well. Hers might be, she might have to go up to the top and throw. So she'll have another elevated throw. So now we get to walk down and we could go the same way, but there's this other steeper way. That Kate enjoys going down. She last time scooted on her bottom. So we'll see if she does it the same way as me or not. Or if she goes back the lumpy way. Which is fine either way. But it's kind of steep right here. So you want me to go first? You want me to go show you going up or down from down there? Well, which one do you think we'll look for? Okay, so I'm going to go first and lead the way for baby Kate. Hopefully I don't fall. This is the steeper way, so I usually just kind of run down it. But Kate is more scared. And so we'll see Kate do what I did if she runs. <clears throat> She's gonna surf down it apparently, or ski down it. It kind of reminds me of um, I when I take Kate down like a block what? when we're skiing. It reminds me when I'm taking you down like a black on my skin. So we threw it up here and Kate's is going to be partially on the hill. So you can see Kate's is on top of the hill. You shouldn't be able to climb it over there. You should be able to climb it right there. Hopefully. Unless you're going to throw it on the ground, which is fine. It's a little jackrabbit. Oh, just a little cottontail. It was like a cottontail. We still have to be aware of snakes. I know it's huge. It's probably the bunny hole. There's a big bunny hole or some sort of hole. It's actually huge. Could be like a kite, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, the jackrabbits here are pretty big. So watching Kate climb, she gets to do a little climbing, which makes the disc got fun too. Yeah. So this is our skull hole one. There's a skull right next to it. You can go up a little bit if you need to. So Kate did not throw it into the ravine. She wanted to keep being by the yucca, sort of. So she threw it over there. Now we get to watch her go down. That's another fun part. And there's a big hole right there. It reminds me of our... <laughs> it reminds me of our, um... The Disney red. The, um... Splash Mountain. <laughs> that thing is like huge though. Oh, what lives in there? So here's my second throw in hole nine. Isn't it? Straight into the yucca. So here's Kate's third throw. Hopefully I don't tape her getting bit by a rattlesnake. That would be scary. So it looks pretty good. It was pretty decent. Huh? Mine is in the yucca. <laughs> in the middle of the yucca plant that hurts to grab. <laughs> it's very painful. Pretty close, huh? 
So this is the hole with the cow skull. Right there. And I just planted right next to it. I'm seeing a few that went inside of it. <laughs> so, so we're on hole 10 at the Rattlesnake Canyon disc golf course out on the farm. So hold. T so this one's gonna okay. be a fun one to try to find it because it's yucky everywhere. <laughs> And there's not a ravine this day. And we're also throwing like where we can't see, so that might be more. Uh oh. <laughs> so I think it's in the open. But we want to go straight ahead, right? For a while? Yeah, it's like straight up ahead, but. Does it go to the right? No. I just go straight. So here's Kate's first throw on hole 10. This is like the log hole. I'm gonna be, the pin is right next to this like really old log. There's mine. Is that yours? Or is that a rock? Or over there by that yucca? Right there. Is that a rock? Is that your disc? Right there. It looks like a rock. I found it. So it's like, it's in down that in that. Light, down in the hill. Yeah. Uh oh. Straight into the other pasture. No, nope, maybe not. I can't tell. I think it's still in the other <laughs> So here's Kate's second shot on hole 10, which is the log hole. And hers is just straight ahead. It wasn't like amazing. the most amazing throw ever. <laughs> So I think mine went over the fence over here, but we'll see, I guess. It was coming back, but we'll see if it's still on the other side or not. But Kate's has to throw hers first, because hers is kind of wimpy. Here's a dead yucca. Tells you how hot it is out here. The yucca is dying. There's yours. So our hole. Right there, Kate. There's a jack I laid on too. Yep. We saw an antelope on this hole last time. It was like way over there in the pasture. Yeah, really pretty, like but our hole is right there by that big log. That's where we're trying to aim. Kate threw it really low. So she's probably gonna get like a five on this hole. At least that was easy enough to find. That was a good one. Okay. I'll get you from up here. <laughs> Still got it. My mine's over here. Not the best spot. It's going for four right now. And she's gonna get a five. Because hers was still a pretty tough shot for me. So, this one was the log hole. So we're gonna be doing hole 11 at the Rattlesnake Canyon disc golf course out at the farm. And this was the finishing of hole 10. So we walk up this little hill, and then we get to throw back down into the ravine. And our hole is gonna be kind of where Kate's bike is, sort of, but down in the little galley. So this one's really long too. You're aiming at my bike? Um, yeah, eventually. So here's Kate's first throw on hole 11. She threw hers kind of down into the ravine, which is fine. So we threw it like around the same distance. Mine is just higher up than hers, than baby Kate's. And you might be able to see your bike up there in the distance. My bike has a flat tire right now and I'm ordering a tube. Yeah, basically. This one's kind of by a log too. 
So Kate's throw is pretty good as long as we can find it, which we should be able to. So that was a pretty good throw. It's Kate's third throw on hole 11. She threw hers not quite as far as mine, but hopefully we can find it. It's kind of blind down there and then it rolls, but you definitely do have to be cautious of rattlesnakes still right here because there's tons of holes everywhere and they could be basically anywhere. Whenever we were at the sand dunes is when Kate saw our first rattlesnake in the open. First. I think Kate's is right there, so hers is in the open, which is good. So then I'll have to try to find mine. So the hole is right there by that log. No, mine's right there. It's in front of yours. Mine's down there. So here's Kate's fourth throw, I think. And I went right above it. Still not terrible. My arms are roasting. I put on sunscreen, but... So mine should be like right next to the hole unless it low. So, on one of my... Mine went really far. I threw it like so far. So I got a four. That's when I should have done my backhand throw. So there's Kate's throw. She got really close to it. But she missed. 